Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Minecraft Hardcore. So, off camera I actually went and got rid of those little wooden tools so they weren't lying around every time I went outside. I collected an apple somewhere. I think that tree is finally despawning. And in this episode, um, we're gonna get some more wood so I can get another barrel. Actually, we probably have plenty of wood right here. Um, so I'm gonna get myself another barrel going so I can have more storage. Increase the wall of storage. It must be done. And then I think after that, we're just, I'm just gonna do a little bit of mining, try and get some better materials. Because as of right now, I have stone tools and that's it. I'd like to get some redstone so I can get a clock. Clocks take redstone, don't they? Clock, where's clock? Um, do I not know how to make a clock? Here, gold. Clock. Can I not make a clock? I cannot make a clock. Huh. That's weird. I guess I need to get the redstone or the other materials first before it'll tell me whether or not I can make it. Alright, well, that's fine. That just means I need to go mining. So let's put granite. Actually, let's put diorite on top. I have the most diorite. And site. And then let's put some lines dirt over here because we always have dirt dirt's a plentiful resource i don't need this anymore oops just trying to eat my sweet berries here and let's get going all right all right let's get down here so, while we're doing this, we might as well just have a little talk about the base. What am I going to do for a base? Um, I have a lot of ideas, but I don't really have a plan. I was thinking about hollowing out the little bit of the ocean, and, or maybe having just like an underwater base or something like that. But I don't really know. I don't really have a plan. I'm, I'd be interested to see what you guys think. Um, but I'm kind of leaning towards having an underwater base, but there's so many different there's so many different options of things I could do. I could I could build like a forest house. I could build like a some kind of like tower or something. There's so many different things you can do, and already we have some iron. That's really good. Um, let's get this iron going. Okay, that lava is very close and it's getting kind of scary. Good thing I brought more pickaxes. And let's gather this iron up. It's eight bits of iron. Get that smelted up a little later and maybe get some better stuff. mine this area out a little bit so oops one two three four five okay so one more block and dang it <laughs> torch I seem to be really bad at hitting the right thing alright there's a lot of dirt here and that kind of worries me dirt is normally indicative of a cave and I don't think I am prepared to tackle a cave and all right I'm actually gonna go up and smelt this iron I can do more mining I can do more mining a little later um, I'm gonna smelt this up Maybe grab some other things while I'm up there. And... 
Melt these, melt these. Um, let's put this stuff away. What time is it? It is daytime. So what, what I was thinking, and that can obviously change, was going out into this ocean here and then building, like, just, like, an underwater base having, like, like, like structures underneath, kind of, like, just, like, have, like, buildings connected by, like, underwater glass tunnels so you can see all the water wildlife while I'm working around in my base. That's what I was thinking, and obviously that can change. I don't know how big this ocean actually is. Um, is there enough room for this? And of course, like, I'll have, like, all kinds of farms and different buildings and stuff. It looks plenty large. There's a lot of kelp. Kelp is always handy. Yeah, that's... Oh, there's, a, like, a desert island. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking for a base. And... I don't know, though. Uh, the, but those are, that's one of many options I could build, like, I could build a tower, I could go over into that desert and build, like, a pyramid, I could do all kinds of things, there's limitless possibilities in this game, and that's why I love it so much. As long as there's enough room for plenty of farms, it's good. some berries and grab some more and let's grab this iron all right um what can we do with iron what do we want to do having a bucket could come in handy in case lava ever comes pouring down on us we can save ourselves um let's just make some more armor and then we have one ingot to spare so we can have one ingot of iron for the future and with this bucket i'll grab some water so this way if we're ever on fire or we ever like fall in lava or anything we can extinguish ourselves and hopefully survive so that'll be always nice to have on the hot bar i think i'm actually going to start carrying torches in my off hand so then, when I go mining, I can easier light up places. I'll just mine for a little bit longer. Hopefully, find some more iron, get some more resources so I can get more armor going, maybe. And maybe even find some redstone or some lapis or something. Maybe even diamonds, you never know. Unfortunately, last season... I got diamonds almost right off the bat, but I was never able to use them, and that made me kind of sad. Hopefully, hopefully that won't happen this time. Hopefully we'll get diamonds and be able to use them, and just get better equipment. Um, one, two, three, four, five, okay. Uh, yeah, it's a lot more handy having torches in the offhand. Um, and while I'm doing this, I'm also collecting plenty of stone for stone bricks and other stone things for later. And... Um, I think I'll just push this one block further. And then head back up. And that lava is very, very close. I wonder if it's right above me. I don't know. All right, well let's go. Let's go back up and put this stuff away. And. I think off camera, I'll do some more mining, hopefully get some better resources. Um, it's becoming night. That's the long chest. Oh, well, actually, I have dirt to put in there. 
Is it becoming night? Yeah, it's definitely becoming night. All right, so I think that is where we're going to call it for today's episode. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.